So what you want to do for the double Kong is you want to try to jog or run towards the obstacle. The next thing that you need to know is that the double Kong is separated into two Kongs and you can tell by the name. So the first Kong is actually to get you height. You push off the obstacle to get height. And the second one is to bring you from your position to a running position. I'll explain more on that in a few seconds. So what you want to do, run towards the obstacle. Sometimes it's good to lower yourself when you approach it like this, but by lowering yourself, you're using your muscles to push yourself up and you'll get more height, more distance that way. So you run towards it, push yourself up. And when you push yourself up, your legs are going to be either horizontal or sometimes they're even higher than your head. And at that point, you'll just be in the air because you're going to have pushed up off of the table. And what you want to do is towards the end of the obstacle, you put your hands again, you push off of the obstacle to bring your legs from being up to being in under you and you can just keep running. It's going to be hard at first to stagger your feet to keep running, but you'll get it with more practice. Let me show you guys how to do it.